Before we get started, make sure to turn on post notification and subscribe to the channel. 10 Things That Could Happen In WWE By The Royal Rumble Number 10 The Miz Steals The WWE Championship Ever since a brand split returned to WWE, The Miz has been the standout heel performer in the entire company. And while he has had some incredible runs as the Intercontinental Champion, we are yet to see him be pushed into the main event scene. It is something that he deserves and is more than capable of and with the rumored WrestleMania match with his rival Daniel Bryan for the WWE Championship being on the table, having Miz sneakily pick up the title prior to the Royal Rumble would be a great move. WWE could have Miz be the man to finally defeat AJ Styles in controversial fashion and then enjoy a feud with them which finishes at Royal Rumble in order to set things up with Bryan moving into the big night. Number 9. Finn Balor's New Club Finn Balor is stuck in a little bit of a rut right now, simply working as an average mid-card babyface who fans like. While this is fine, Balor is capable of so much more and it is time that the company get that out of him. Balor has thrived as a leader of a club several times in his career. In WWE, during his brief Balor club run and in Japan as the leader of the Bullet Club, one of the greatest factions in the history of wrestling. With Gallows and Anderson doing nothing right now, it would make sense to bring them back over to Raw and have Balor reunite the band for a strong run heading into WrestleMania, putting him over as a big threat on the way. Number 8. Dean Ambrose finally goes full lunatic. WWE finally pulled the trigger on a Dean Ambrose heel turn during an incredibly emotional episode of Monday Night Raw and it was a great decision as fans were more than ready to see a new side of him. His work as a heel prior to his main roster run with WWE is excellent and that is likely going to translate into what we see from him moving forward. However, now it is time to take things up a notch and really have him live up to his gimmick. For years, Ambrose has been claiming he's a lunatic fringe without many actions to back that nickname up. Yet now, he's a fully fledged heel. It is time for WWE to crank it up a notch and allow the lunatic out of his cage. Number 7. Sasha Banks Finally Turns Heel WWE simply loves teasing the situation. The company has had countless great opportunities to turn Sasha Banks into a heel, a role where she shines the brightest. But for some reason, the company hasn't taken any of them. Just before the Royal Rumble and the road to WrestleMania would be the ideal time to turn Sasha Banks, kickstarting a major feud with her best friend Bayley, leading all the way to a final grudge match at WrestleMania, putting her back as a legit boss who is simply out to be the biggest star possible is what everyone wants and in return, WWE could get an even bigger female star than they already have. So there's nothing to lose. Number 6. Bray Wyatt's Last Chance Bray Wyatt has had a tough time in WWE as he has been a victim of some terrible booking throughout his career which has stopped him from reaching his full potential as he has all the tools to be a top main event star. Wyatt has had moments at the very top such as when he was WWE Champion and then moments where he has been barely been used as he is currently. Since Matt Hardy retired, Wyatt has been kept from TV and when he returns, it is likely going to be his last chance to be a main event star. Hopefully, Wyatt can come back with a brand new gimmick and walk into the Royal Rumble as one of the top contenders to win the entire thing or at least with some new purpose instead of what fans have had to endure previously. Number 5. Shawn Michaels Gets His Groove Back Shawn Michaels making his return to wrestling at the controversial crown jewel is something that has upset many fans. With the WWE Universe wanting to see him in America for a major pop at a big event such as the Royal Rumble or WrestleMania, hopefully HBK has an excellent performance in the tag team match and that he gets his groove back allowing WWE to use him again outside of the show, preferably in a major feud against the current talent. The WWE Universe is certainly happy to see Michaels back, with that being one of the only positives to come from Crown Jewel's controversy. But the WWE Universe wants dream matches with Styles and Daniel Bryan, and that is something that could easily happen, possibly at the Rumble itself. Number 4. Nikki Cross is over Fans were in uproar when Nikki Cross didn't debut on the main roster alongside the rest of Sanity, but given how things have gone for the stable, it is possibly the best things that could have happened to her. However, it is being reported that WWE plans to move several talents from NXT to the main roster after Survivor Series. And when it comes to the women's division, Nikki Cross is the most likely to make that jump. With other top stars being involved in the title picture, Cross could join Aleister Black to continue the recent partnership on Raw or SmackDown where Cross is likely going to thrive with their incredible character. Number 3. Luke Harper Goes Solo Everything finally seemed to be falling into place for Luke Harper and Eric Groban as the Bludgeon Brothers. The tag team were dominating everyone in their paths and seemed set for a long run with the SmackDown tag team title. 
titles. That was when until Rowan went down with an injury, forcing WWE to switch the titles to the New Day and pull the Bludgeon Brothers from TV, which is a huge shame for Harper, especially since he's the more talented of the pair. While WWE is unlikely to keep Harper simply sitting on the sidelines for no reason, so you can expect to see the former Wyatt family member back, going solo on his own soon, and hopefully he gets the solid mid-card run he deserves. Number 2. Rey Mysterio Flies Again Rey Mysterio's WWE return is something that fans have been waiting for ever since he made a surprise appearance at the Royal Rumble at the start of the year and now he is back mixing it up on SmackDown Live each week. Mysterio is set to be a major part of WWE going forward and it's going to be exciting to see him mix it up with today's roster but there's a big opportunity for WWE to push 205 Live by having the greatest cruiserweight of all time appear on the show. While it might not be the first thing on fans mind Minds. Seeing Mysterio back to where it all began for him, competing in some classic cruiserweight matches would be a huge moment and hopefully that can happen, even if it's just for a few special featured matches. Number 1. Randy Orton returns into the title picture At the start of the year, the thought of having Randy Orton back in the world title contention would have made many fans turn the TV off. But there's something refreshing about watching the Viper work right now that has meant the WWE Universe is invested in him once again. In the ring, Orton has always been one of the smoothest and when he brings his A game, there are very few better. But now, he's back as a full blown heel, his character now feels fresh, something that couldn't have been said about him for the past few years. Orton has been back at his absolute best with his vicious attacks and incredible promos and seeing him as a top heel going after AJ Styles or another major world champion babyface is something that could easily happen and fans will likely be behind it. <laughs>